Robert here with uh, an update on the Steinway L uh, work. Uh, the soundboard's been scraped. Um, next step is it being dried out and uh, dealing with any cracks that show up. And I can tell you right now, I'm seeing seeing something here. Um, also, right here. And I was thinking I saw another spot. Uh, yeah, right in here. So uh, those are the three main spots. Those are toward the back of the board. But let me get a wider shot of the board here. Um, they're all in this area here. Um, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and get drying going on the board. And uh, we'll let it sit a couple of maybe three days. And then we'll come back and address the ribs and we'll get the treatment on it. Uh, matter of fact, while I'm speaking of treatment of the soundboard, here is uh, the Baldwin M that uh, I just finished up. Uh, it's dry now, very glossy, but it's, it's dry to the touch. Um, but I'm not going to leave it glossy. Um, I'm going to put a coat of lacquer on it. I'm going to sand it and put a coat of lacquer down um, to knock down the gloss a little bit. But uh, this uh, this preservative acts to uh, keep the board from cracking again, as well as stiffening the uh, pores of the grain in the uh, wood. It, it restores some of the life back to the board, basically. So uh, I'm excited to see how this turns out. I know it's going to be good. Every piano I've done has turned out spectacularly. And matter of fact, there's another Baldwin, a Baldwin Model C. If you'll look through the videos, you'll find uh, I took a video of the owner playing it after uh, delivering it. And he's still, um, it's probably been a month or more. And uh, I, I still get uh, messages from him um, about the piano and how well it's performing and sounding and and some of the uh, some of his friends that come by and hear it that are players as well really enjoy that piano so it does make a difference um, so uh, also in this case is sanded um, and it reveals quite easily that this piano was ebonized you can see here um, you know, different types of woods on the cabinet. So this is a black only piano. And I guess that's about it for now. So, um, if you come across this video on YouTube and not through the uh, YouTube channel, it's Beavers Piano TV, go over to uh, beaverspiano.com and you'll see some listings of other projects, pictures, and a little bit of talk, um, over there. Um, I don't post all of the jobs that I do. Some get posted, uh, just pictures mainly posted over on the website. So you may see some stuff over there that you don't see videos of, uh, on the YouTube channel. So, uh, click subscribe. Uh, you can get notifications of, uh, new videos. Uh, if you like the videos, click like, and, uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks.